Welcome back. Our hearts are with those who continue to recover after a deadly tornado outbreak in Middle Tennessee. An expedited federal disaster declaration for the areas affected has been approved by President Joe Biden on Wednesday. Now, the covered counties are, of course, Davidson, Dixon, Montgomery, and Sumner. Now, this recovery assistance is available to all four counties hit by the tornado outbreak and the severe storms. Mm. And now, big name artists are gathering under one roof, rallying behind our community as the work continues to pick up the pieces. Now, artists like Hardy, Nate Smith, and of course, many others are going to perform at a benefit concert this weekend, Sunday night. And of course, to tell us all about it are Matt and Christine. Now, uh, they're the faces behind. Find the very popular Instagram at Nashville, Tennessee. Yes, yes. welcome. welcome in, yeah, guys. absolutely. Thank Thanks you. For us. Yeah. Tell yeah. us about Unplugged Tennessee. So it's coming together really last minute here because <laughs> um, obviously it's something that we didn't expect, and uh, you know it's a benefit concert for to benefit you know people that were impacted by the tornadoes. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah. it was last minute. Matt and I just we had kind of talked. He had done some work previously in 2020 raised about like half a million with a t-shirt fund that he did and uh you know yeah. we were like what can we do to bring the community together like mm -hmm. let's help let's raise some money for these people and so we were like we've got a lot of friends in the music industry and you know it's nashville so there's a lot of artists in, in town and uh we wanted to just bring them out see how many people we could get to do this show and all proceeds are going to hands-on nashville and red cross tennessee very good matt i mean yeah. how did you look at this lineup yeah yeah, well, I mean, I'm sitting right next to it. You know, I, <laughs> we came in the office and we had put a fundraiser up on our Instagram page, and we we had a good response from it. But we put a pretty lofty goal of 20 grand uh, to raise, so uh, we weren't there yet. So I really challenged our team and uh, kind of you know got on you a little bit, and yeah. I was like, hey, let's get let's get to work. And uh, shortly thereafter, you came and said, hey, can I spearhead a concert? And I think we can we can bang it out. So yeah, some and great friends some, stepped I was up. Say, yeah. yeah, really great friends that we've got that were just like. I gave them a call and I was like, hey, this is what we're thinking about doing. And immediately they were just starting to reach out to people. And it was cool to see just how many people wanted to be involved. As soon as like word got out, like, hey, this is what we're doing. Yeah. Like they were like, we want to be involved. We were just like, we're like fielding all these calls. We're like, oh my gosh, this person wants to be involved. And this person wants to be involved. And it was just the, a testament to the Nashville community and how many people wanted to come together to help just yeah. everyone in need. Yeah. And working with... Um Two nonprofits, uh, Red Cross of Tennessee and Hands on Nashville. Uh, she had mentioned the experience we had in the 2020 storm. Uh, it's super important that we have, um, it, you know, a lot of what they do in many ways is a lot like being ready, being prepped for the next one to come, yeah. while at the same time being the frontline defense mm -hmm. for th what we just witnessed this weekend. So I'm um, really glad to be able to uh, get to them so quickly and get their support to run with this. And uh, yeah, and even yeah. with the venue too, I mean, exit in, we'd reached out to a couple different venues and they were pretty much just ready to go. They're like, what do you need? Like, yeah. we're here, we're right. ready to go. Same with the charities um, yeah. and, and just everyone involved, yeah. you know, from the artists to the artists, all of their team and just, you know, people wanting to, willing to donate money to. And, and it's just, it's just a great testament. And you guys said it, I mean, community, right? Music city, music. Matt, in, in your words, why do you think music is so, so healing in itself? Mm -hmm. Uh, well, it just brings people together, you know, especially here in Asheville, of course. And, uh, you know, when you go through certain things in your life, and often, I, I don't know, personally, I can remember it through a song, you know, a song you've been listening to at that time. So, yeah, you know, Nashville heals through its art community. And, uh, and, and, that's, why, and that's why we didn't have a hard time booking this, mm -hmm. you know, so quickly, mm -hmm. you know. Um, so we were very blessed to, to live in a town like this. And... Uh, in a way that, and how we respond. We've been through a lot over you know, several, you know, past three or four years in Nashville with different things that have happened. And we see this time and time again happening. So um, we're just really thankful to be a part of something like that. And, um, you know, see how far we can take it. You know, we're yeah. having conversations about uh, if there's sponsors out there or if we're doing charity auction and, you know, the tickets uh, sold really quickly. They yeah. sold out. Great. Um, it was like an hour, within yeah. a little over an hour. I mean, yeah. we were calling each other. We're like, I think it sold out. I think it sold out. They're the like, internet's broken. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was trying to buy some, you know, yeah. and I, like, we couldn't get them, so. It was pretty so, yeah. crazy. And, and awesome. yeah, I mean, just wow. But as we know, the work 
doesn't end here. So thank you for all that you're doing right now. And we know that you're going to continue to show up for Nashville TN, <laughs> my go, friends. Yeah. Yeah. I know that you feel that responsibility. And I thank you for both of you for what you're doing. Thank awesome. you. It's going to be a fun night. Unplugged for Tennessee is happening December 17th at the Exit Inn, Local on 2. We'll have more details about the event on localon2.com. And if you would like to give back, WKRN is teaming up with the Red Cross as well to raise funds for storm relief. It's a way that you can help right from your own home. And all you have to do is hold up your phone right now and scan this QR code uh, to make a donation and to make a difference. And so far, about $19,000 has been raised for relief. Local on 2, we'll be right back.